What's up, everybody? Um, I wanted to show off a Jedi uh, weathered box that I made. And uh, I needed a video to really demo um, everything that she um, that she can do. So without further ado, um, this is uh, an example of. Oh, sorry, it's hard to navigate with my um, tripod. So you might be noticing that the top panel isn't on because again it's um, I haven't had a chance to put it on but there will be a top cover panel there um, I don't know if you can see whoop. if you can see from the other side anyway okay so I wanted to demo the lights so this is um, a dual paneled um, display box <clears throat> meaning that there's a panel of lights in the back and one on the bottom. Um, you can order different um, sets from me. You can order a dual panel. Um, you can order a single panel. Um, you can order plain. You can order Sith. Um, yeah. So, um, and if you do a single panel, you can have it either placed on the bottom or on the back. It's it's up to you. Um, so let me turn the light off so I can demo some of the lighting. So um, each pack, or each platform, sorry, and I call the the panels with the lights platforms. Each one has a um, LED pack in it, and each one comes with a remote, so if you do dual like you're seeing here, you're going to get two remotes. Um, you can use both. You can use one to control both, but it's a little. it can be a little finicky. So if I show you, let's see if it works. So if I point over to the back, the range on these doesn't go very far, but um, let's see here. Oh, duh. I didn't turn on the... <laughs> I didn't turn on the... Um, uh, so the battery, I'll show you at the, towards the end of the video, but um, these, yep, there's one, and the battery pack um, has a, a button on it to turn it on itself. Um, the, uh, uh, let's see, are you going to listen? There we go. So um, the wiring uh, has a separate USB. If you look here, you can pull this apart on each one, each uh, platform, and you could connect it to an outlet uh, USB plug and plug it into your wall. So you have that electric power to these instead of the battery packs. But the battery packs are USB, so they can connect to these wires. <clears throat> so. Let me try to get you some better looks here. This was a lot of fun to make. Um, and, uh, get you off the tripod. There we go. So, get you some cool side views. And you can, um, you know, you can hide these wires however you want. Um, and I'll explain in a minute. Now what's even cooler is um, these have different uh, modes and different colors they can do. Um, this particular set, for some reason, uh, one of the strips, the red, doesn't work, so um, I'm going to have to swap that out. But <clears throat> um, you can see the other colors, like for example, you've got blue. Um, let's see, green, and like a lightish bluish white. And then what's also cool is, um, you can do different modes. 
So technically both of them were supposed to, there we go. So you can do different modes where they like change colors. And then depending on how you use the two remotes and how you get connection to both of them, some of them, they might like synchronize um, or sometimes they might like do um, different modes all on their own. So it's almost like a disco, right? Let's try a fade. Let's try fade again. So, um, what I really was excited about was, um, for the panels, originally, um, I had like a white wax paper there so that you could still have the lights come through, but then I didn't like the white against, you know, um, the box it just didn't fit. So over it, I put a layer of black, um, black tinted uh oh, excuse me um what's that stuff called um cellophane cellophane over them so let me show you oh and then how it comes out is um from the side you can push it and slide it out and that would be how you'd gain access to what you have inside. Like so. Um, so if you end up getting multiples from me and you stack them, because you can stack them going up, um, I'll make sure that the drawers are, they can come out all from the same direction. That way, you know, if you have something you want to put next to it, um, you can mainly put it on one side or I can stagger it. You know, I can have the bottom one come out this way. I can have the top one come out that way. It's entirely up to you. But anyway, so let me show you what's all going on back here. So again, each panel comes with its own set of lights, which means its own battery pack. Um, but here, is where um, you can undo the twist tie or or not, and then you can unplug the USB and then plug this into a wall, a wall uh, USB plug, and then plug it into the wall. And the same thing with both of them. Um, and then just hook it up to like a power strip or something. And yeah, that kind of sums sums it all up. Um, I like to attach the back one with um, command strips, so you can you can pop this off if you want, leave it there if you want. Um, I don't do it to the bottom because this pack, it doesn't sit flush inside the housing. So, you know, when you I attach this there, then the thing, the case, like, kind of sits slanted. So uh, I'm going to supply you with uh, a command strip attached to it. And then you can kind of, you know, loosely attach it, give yourself some more slack by undoing the twist tie, um, you know, and decide where you want to, uh, where you want to attach it and hide it. And also it's got its own light. So these buttons on the battery packs, you're going to want to turn them off if you're using the, if you're using the battery packs. Um, if not, you would have the power button here as well. Um, and there's one of these under there too for this strip as well. You don't have to use that to turn it on and off, but you can besides, you know, using the remote. So, yeah, I uh, was super excited how this is turning out. And technically these legs are um, adjustable if you want them to be, you can make them higher and take the platform off the bottom a little bit. They're not like, you know, super deep legs, but yeah, so 
And then here's like, you know, close up of the weathering job. I was like, okay, I'm only gonna go for a light weather. But the more the more I was kind of getting to completion, the more I wanted to keep going. So I would consider this definitely heavy, a heavy weathered. Um, I can do lightly weathered as well. So yeah, if you're interested, hit me up. Um, no matter what, it'll always come with the legs. If you don't do lighting, I usually supply um, a black microfiber cloth that kind of lays across the bottom inside uh, with the legs on top. Um, the hilts itself are not included. You know, I would expect you have your own to put in. Uh, yeah, and that kind of sums it up. Thanks, thanks for uh, viewing, and may the force be with you.